Tonight on Ideal Interiors, the charming Palma Tieno shows us how chandeliers, lamps and accessories can create nuance and subtle beauty in your home. We get onto the factory floor at PG Bison to experience the creative process of how boards, bloom hinges and corner floors will bring the sparkle back to your life. We delve into the world of color, as described by Rakesh Rao, the CEO of Crown Paints. Our presenters are Pete and Casera, and our location continues to be the architectural masterpiece that is the home of Tobias and Jane in an upmarket Nairobi neighborhood. Tobias and Jane's home is an architectural masterpiece and they wanted it to reflect the family's fun-loving lifestyle. So they did the interior deco themselves. Living together in their dream home is a gift the couple regard as one of their greatest achievements. And their children, 13-year-old Ashby and 6-year-old Alma and 19-year-old Angel, who is currently in the United States, certainly share their enthusiasm. Jane began by taking Casera on a tour of the open plan kitchen where we discovered that the secret to taming a fiery red is to balance it with pops of white. Here, a smattering of dove white wall accents keep the bold red in check. An open plan kitchen, anytime. Great, I like the functionality. Yeah. Very easy to serve, uh -huh. very easy to communicate with your visitors. Yeah. Sorry, could I pour you a cup of tea? Please do, please yeah, do. I you. wouldn't mind some. Okay. The open plan kitchen slides effortlessly into the dining area where Jane has chosen a palette of green, yellow and white with walls dressed in African art, giving it the much needed warm feeling expected of such a magnificent home. The Lucite dining chairs and white top dining table add character to the room. So would you say you nailed it and this is your dream kitchen? Yeah, I nailed it. For this one I did. Yeah. Yeah. Do you feel there, uh, what, what aspects do you think maybe you would want to add on if you ever did another kitchen? If I was to do another one? Yeah. yeah. I think I'd maybe add maybe two ovens. Yeah. Yeah. And a bigger kitchen than this one, <laughs> obviously. We never, you know, we never, have, enough enough we never have enough. Yeah. But this is so far so good. This yeah. is my dream. Yeah. Yeah. I must say it is like it's spacious. There's so much light coming in. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah. So, which is your favorite place in this kitchen? I love the island, obviously. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. So, I must say, you know, you were talking about functionality okay. of your kitchen. Mm -hmm. You know, do you feel you got enough space for storage? Because that's always a challenge for most kitchens I've seen. Yeah, I have enough. You see, the space, the kitchen is quite big. Mm -hmm. So, there's a lot of space. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you yeah. can see there's so many drawers. Sufficient drawers and lot. cupboards. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. good. Yeah. I, I, I'm telling you, I love the layout. Oh, I love thanks. the layout. The lower living room offers distinct charm. It has high ceilings with large artwork over the fireplace, providing a visual anchor for the room. The fireplace in turn provides radiant energy throughout. There is an aquarium that is a source of enjoyment and relaxation, a perfect combination of harmony and balance. Jane has created intimacy and kept this living space cozy, despite its grand attitude, by hanging a grand chandelier that helps to bring your eyes down. The use of gorgeous gold drapes make for a glamorous decorating statement and the icing on the cake is the large brown leather sofa that allows the couple to relax in comfort and socialize in style. So when your when your daughters were involved in selecting the color, like yeah. what what colors did they choose? And <laughs> actually, there's obviously girls, oh. the purple. Yeah. Oh, pink, that's my favorite color, yes. The pink, yeah. yellow, green. Mm. There's all sorts of lovely colors. Okay. How have you set up the rest of your house to make sure you maximize on entertaining your guests? There's some uh, instruments around, like there's a piano at the launch. So my younger daughter Alma plays piano. Beautiful. Yeah. I'd love to hear her sometime. You will, you will. <laughs> Is she good? For her age, she's really good. Nice, I'd love yeah. to hear that.
two modern staircases lead onto the first floor where we find the family room that is finished in an inviting rustic red from the walls to the leather sofa. This makes it speak of luxury. Next to it is the library that is finished in broken white, making for an ideal work area that Tobias, Jane and the children gather to do their assignments or homework as the case may be. I heard a weird sound and I noticed you have a, a little bird at the corner. Oh, <laughs> that's Kasuku. It's got... Wow. <laughs> and anything you say after this, you repeat. He was going to repeat. Oh, yeah. That must be dangerous. Not really. <laughs> yeah? No. He's never gone out of uh, and said the wrong thing at the wrong time. No. Yeah? Well, that's nice. And I love that touch that you actually have a parent yeah, and at he's, home. He, she's very beautiful. Actually, yeah. she's red and gray. Mm -hmm. yeah, very rare. I know you said your daughters chose their favorite colors for their rooms. What color did you choose for your master bedroom? Wow. My master bedroom is lime. Mm -hmm. gr lime green. Lime green, yeah. White. It's quite a mixture of colors. Mm -hmm. It's all mixed up. By the way, I love playing with colors. Mm. So with actually the bold ones mm. and mix them up and come up with, boom, something, something yeah. nice. Oh, that must be. Yeah. Cool. Did Toby have any input on the color choice? <laughs> Yeah, he did. Yeah? Yeah, he oh, did. Okay, yeah. okay, that's good, that's good. Yeah. Most men are left out of this thing, so... Yeah, I, I know, <laughs> but Toby's hands on. Yeah, so that's good. He also loves colours. Yeah. Yeah, a lot. Yeah. Like, the house, if you notice, it's mm. all coloured. Yes, yeah. yeah. The guest room is also orange, mm -hmm. bright orange, but it fits in well. Yeah. Yeah. Tobias and Jane have certainly made their home a sanctuary to savor. And that reminds us of the poem that says, live your best life starting with today. Make sure it's a happy one every step of the way. Next, Pamatieno of Palacina Interiors delves into the world of accessorizing your home. The word chandelier is instantly synonymous with class ornate hanging lights that are just as much decoration as they are light sources. And you might as well know that chandelier originates from the French word chandelle. Chandelier literally means candle holder. Pam Matieno of Palacina Interiors was only too happy to tell Pete what role chandeliers play in decorating and accessorizing your living space. Well, there's a chandelier in general in a space is to decorate your ceiling and to bring down the high depth but also to give you that uh, beautiful lighting that you're looking for in your living space. Now with Palacina we have different types of chandeliers. We have pendant chandeliers, we have wrought iron chandeliers, we have crystal clear chandeliers and we have lantern chandeliers and these chandeliers each play a different role in a different living room space. For example, if you have a high ceiling, we would recommend you go for something that, that is a bit dramatic. You know, something that is quite big to fill up that space. And if you have a low ceiling, we would recommend a smaller chandelier because the size also, you want to balance the size. Well, with the chandeliers, we play with the different kind of settings that we have. If you are doing a gold setup, we tend to go with uh, either champagne or that rustic wrought iron chandelier, either in a brown finish or a grey finish. And if you're doing more of a, a silver setup, then we'll go with a crystal clear chandelier. The trend in contemporary chandeliers today is fresh, clean and fabulous. The selection of innovative designs at Palacina Interiors combines exceptional forms and finishes that will give a modern look that matches a wide variety of rooms. Another thing that I have noticed walking around is the manner in which you have used mirrors to decorate the rooms. Yes. And there are so many different kinds of mirrors. Mirrors do play a big role. Now, when you have a big space, you can play with uh, several mirrors just to accessorize that wall. Now, if you have a smaller space, you can then again put a bigger mirror just to give you a wider space. And with our mirrors, we have wooden mirrors, and we have wrought iron mirrors, and we also have rustic look brass mirrors. Um, what sort of advice would you give 
anybody who wants to accessorize their living room, for instance. The beauty about these accessories on coffee table or on your side tables, they're just to accessorize, you know, give you that extra final look that you're looking for in your space. Keep warm and stylish as the cold nights draw in this November with throws for the sofa or just to wrap around yourself. If you're like Pete and are not sure what a throw is, Pam explained to him that decorative throws and throw blankets can add texture, warmth and colour to your bedroom or living room. For a bowl chair accent, drape a throw widthwise across a seat's cushion. Every time I have looked at your catalogues and when I've gone online, I have seen a word that has continuously reverberated, and that is throws. What are these things you're throwing away? <laughs> Actually, they're not, we, you, don't, you don't throw them away. The purpose of a throw on your sofa, you know how sometimes you just want to snuggle, maybe with your partner, or you want to keep warm? That's the purpose of a throw. They're just to keep you warm when you're sitting. You don't have to bring your blanket from the bedroom. That's the purpose of having a throw. Just, you know, to cover yourself while you're enjoying your living room. After the break, we go to the factory floor of PG Bison and experience a high-tech creative process and discover a world of magical hinges and everlasting floors. The Ideal Interiors Expo has in the past six years grown to become the premier event of the interiors industry in East Africa. And now, introducing Ideal Interiors Expo 2016. Are you an interior supplier of furniture and furnishings, kitchens and accessories, bathrooms, wall finishes, lighting, flooring and many more? Well, it is your chance to exhibit at the region's finest expo on interiors for homes, offices and hotels. Book your space now. The Ideal Interiors Expo, setting standards in the interiors industry. Bison is one of East Africa's top distributors of the widest color range of medium density fiber board, particle boards, a selection of complementary decorative materials such as kitchen wax tops, sinks, laminate flooring, engineered wood flooring, doors and furniture fittings. It is driven by adhering to its customer needs. The value proposition that PG Bison offers to its customers is in the form of quality products, value-added services, a big product range, and technical support and customer relations. When Pete visited their premises, he met with Tahir, who took him through the creative process and the high-tech equipment that is in use on the factory floor. We are aging it, we are drilling it, we are routing it, and all of them the machines are high-tech machines, they are clever machines and whole production components each by each has a on it ID number as long as we don't make a mistake. Tahir meticulously described to Pete the value-added services such as resizing and machining of particle and MDF boards to clients' customized specifications such as cutting, edging, drilling and component labeling. The whole process culminates in flat pack and ready to assemble and fit components for the end user. After spending time with Tahir, Pete met with Esther, the charming Bloom & Chrono brand product manager who was all too happy to take him through the nitty-gritty of the different hinge systems on offer from the touch to open door systems all the way to the soft close system from the world famous Bloom brand. So here we have a touch to open door. You don't need any handles on this. It's basically a touch to open door. We use a special hinge. This is a tip-on hinge. It doesn't have any spring as compared to the other hinges because it needs a, once you tip the door, it needs to to just swing open. Basically makes your makes it very easy for you to use it. What did you call that hinge? It's a tip-on hinge. Tip-on hinge. Tip hinge. yes. And what, why do you call it tip-on hinge? Because uh, it doesn't have any spring inside as compared to the other hinges that we carry. I'll show you the hinge system that we currently carry. 
Here we have a 165 degree hinge. This hinge uh, comes with a soft close mechanism, what Bloom normally calls blue motion. Blue motion basically helps the door to close silently and effortlessly. Yes. And then here we have the tip on hinge. Basically, it doesn't have any spring on it. You, you use this if you don't want handles in your kitchen and you combine with a tip on to a tip on for doors, which is this. So what does the tip on for doors do? Basically, a tip on for doors will, will you, you, it's attached to open system. You don't need any, any handles on your doors. And the beauty about uh, Bloom products, it makes you, you can actually multitask when you're working in your kitchen. For example, you're cutting something, you can easily tap your door, grab something and continue, close it and continue with what you're doing. After a most captivating session that featured the tip on hinges and 165 degree soft close blue motion series, Esther then took Pete on a tour of the Chrono brand laminate floors that she described as zero maintenance and require no sanding or polishing. The advantage with Chrono, the laminates are 90% wood and we get them from sustainable forests. So at least uh, you're sure you're getting a good thing and uh, there's continuity in their production. So how do you clean them? This is a very easy product to maintain and clean. It, okay, I can call it a no maintenance product. You don't need to polish, you don't need to sand it. You just clean it with a damp mop, dust it once in a while and you're good to go. This wow. will last you for a very, very long time. Really? This is much better compared to the solid wood, which will need frequent sanded, frequent uh, spanishing, which you don't need with the laminate floors. Finally, Pete caught up with the key account client manager, Anthony, who in immense detail described the value-added services that PG Bison provides to their diverse range of clientele, which includes developers, shop fitters, homeowners, architects, quantity surveyors right through to your neighborhood carpenter. So if I, I walked in today as I have walked in and I was a client wanting, for instance, to have a kitchen done, how would you help me? Uh, first thing, we are not uh, kitchen and uh, wardrobe manufacturers. What we do, we provide uh, uh, raw materials to do your kitchen, your wardrobe. Yeah, from hinges, from screws, from boards, handles, sinks, uh, kitchen worktops, and all that. So we'll show you exactly what we have, all the colors that we do have, yeah. The other thing that we do, we also do components, cut components, yeah. Uh, this is where by now the client maybe has a, an installer, a fundi, they have their own drawings, they come up with their own cutting list, and we'll take that and uh, do what we call an optimization, yeah? And this optimization will give us now the, the number of boards that are, that are needed, the number of uh, the meterage of it, uh, uh, aging that is required. If we're doing any grooving, are we doing any molding on the, on the, on the, on the, on the uh, door frontals? All that will, will be captured there. Clearly, PG Bison provide the industry with the raw material to create the finished product and all you need to do is give the details of what you want. Next, we discover the adventure of color at Crown Paints where cool Metallica can give any room a sophisticated air. Can you imagine how much space 2.5 million liters of paint would take up? Well, Pete wouldn't, but that's how much paint Crown Paints manufactures every month. Pete made a trip to their industrial area office to meet up with the CEO, Rakesh Rao, to discover the adventure of color and to keep up with the latest trends and style in color. A Crown Paints, uh, we believe and transform lifestyle to colors to the people. Uh, we have been established in 1958, so we, we completed more than 50 years, 55 years in this country. And we have been leading brands, uh, uh, we manufacture all type of range from uh, decoratives, uh, architecture scooting, industrial, um, automotive, road marking. Uh, various resin, adhesive, uh, all, all type of paint which is required uh, to, to color the life uh, of any person or to transform any metals or any surface. And we've been pro providing uh, all type of coating solutions uh, to the people here. Uh, 
we have been like uh, last few years we've been quite aggressive on uh, establishing ourselves as a fashion design brand because what happened uh, paint was uh, become boring and become very conventional uh, just uh, try a few colors blue white cream and you know few finishes so whenever I, I travel I learn a lot of things and I always look for some innovation uh, to bring innovation in these countries and we give more and more options and solutions to the clients so they can able to you know uh, you know transform the house because I believe that uh, the color is the most significant uh, final product to beautify your homes or any projects. For example, like uh, any project, you have a maximum steel and cement and furnitures, all can't be seen. Only you see is color. So we believe that uh, we need to provide uh, uh, the best quality, best solutions, and innovative solutions uh, to our customers for the commercials, interior decorators, architectures, and all segments we've been serving. Listening to you, I get the impression that you're not just a product company, you're actually a service provider. And when I passed through your showroom earlier on, one of the things that I saw was something that was described as a paint visualizer. What is all that about? I think paint visualizer is what happens generally. Uh, it just gives you guidance uh, how the, you, you can choose your color schemes uh, and how what color combination you would like to use because nowadays people would like to use a variety of colors and, and funky colors, beautiful colors, soft white, cream, dark shades, so various combinations they would like to use it. So color visualizers uh, has a software which give you guidelines that uh, we, have, we have given all the options of kitchen, bedrooms, drawing, dining and um, all sort of uh, house uh, your setup. Talking about being one step ahead and talking about transforming dreams into reality. I noticed that you also have a training function. Is the training for your customers, for your employees? Or who gets involved in training? I think we believe that uh, if you want to make your products successful, uh, people must have a knowledge of the products. So we have chosen all the categories, not only one category is like uh, only painters. So we choose uh, different categories and different knowledge. Like we, we, paint, we train painters, we train our shopkeepers, assistants who have been sell our brands. We, we, we train contractors, painters who are on various uh, on sites because many times these uh, skills, how to apply paints will also make a lot of difference on giving the finishes because if you do not apply a proper system, a proper coating, proper thinning and all adjustment need to be do to get the best uh, results of the paints. So we, we, we train all type of categories of people. We also run a lot of workshops for our architects, young architects and uh, professionals. We go and uh, you know, have a, uh, our, we make a presentation and we talk about all our products and the features. We've been really, really very, very focused on educating our clients what are products and what are the benefits which can, uh, can give a very long lasting uh, you know, service to them. Because paint is, uh, of course, um, uh, decorations, but it's also protections. Uh, through paints, we protect walls and structure. So we make sure that we provide world-class uh, best solutions to Kenyan markets and, uh, and, and uh, offer value for the money. Excellent, which brings me to the actual product. You've offered training, people understand what kind of products you have. Looking at your company profile, I came across names such as decorative paints, industrial paints, intermediate products, road paintings. What is this all about? Why so many varied products? And what's the difference, for instance, between decorative paints and industrial paints? Decorative generally used for a, a structure, protecting a sur surface and wall uh, for a cement based wall. Industrial being used uh, for uh, industrial coating where you have a large consumption of like coil coating for example to paint uh, uh, rope sheets. So it is like very used in production where quality of most of the products have been used in producing bulk quantity and protecting a metal surface. Most of the time, industrial paints are protecting various types of metal surfaces. To bring rapid technology improvements, Crown has sought and obtained international brand partnerships for product lines which provide solutions such as Kalinga Stone.
Crown's heritage and quality has been the key to the company's consistent performance and growth, supported by its loyal employees, partners and dealers. Join us next week as we join PG Bison in their first class training program. We go to Crown Paints where we are taken through the process of choosing the ideal color and paint for your home and we learn how we can save over 100% of our electricity bills by making the right choices at Durable Electricals.